on this last day of painting, I'm gonna be using my last tertiary colors, blue and green. And I wanna obviously fill in any white spaces we have left. I don't wanna see any white paper. And I also wanna make sure I'm creating contrast. So because I'm using blue and green, and I already have some green kind of in my background, I might wanna kind of think about where I put the green. Maybe I wanna use more blue and white to create that contrast. I feel like I'm done with my tertiary color, so I'm gonna take the paint left in my brush and just kind of go ahead and spread that out onto my kind of background paper. And then you might be like me where you still have some little areas of like white on your paper, or you could also be like me where there's maybe some numbers that are a little bit hard to read. So at this point, you can go back with a color that you haven't used yet and you can add some little areas of color to make certain things pop. You just wanna make sure that you're not over mixing them because they can mix on your paper to make colors you aren't really going for. And please just make sure that at this point, if you are um, getting colors straight from the container of paint, that you're really cleaning that brush out and also drying it off before going into the next color. So I'm gonna use a little bit of kind of pink to go back and make some of my white areas that I still see on my paper kind of be filled in. And again, I'm still kind of doing these just short little strokes of color, I'm not adding a lot. And if I feel like there's an area where it's a little bit hard to see my number, I might add a little bit of this kind of last little color into my background. And I'm gonna keep on working until I've kind of filled in all these remaining little white spots with just some little areas of color. 